After celebrating 20 years last Thanksgiving, the National Dog Show returns for year 21 tomorrow, right here on WBOI NBC. And it's guaranteed that there will be a new Best in Show winner, as Mark Barger has a preview. We have a repeat winner. A Scottish deerhound named Claire became the first back-to-back -back winner in 20 years at the National Dog Show last year. She's a great specimen of her breed, first of all, and then she was a great show dog as well. Um, you have to, it's a dog show and you got to show. But Claire's not showing for a three-peat. No, Claire's retired to motherhood, and we don't know when that's going to happen, but that's what she's pointing for. That leaves host John O'Hurley and expert analyst David Fry awaiting a new Best in Show winner. Every dog is distinct in their form and their function. And it underscores the point that really this is a celebration of the rich history of breeding. Release the hounds. 212 breeds will be competing for top honors. A lot of dog in a small space. And a face that looks like a cigar just blew up in it. The Bracco Italiano is among three new breeds. Elegant, beautiful dog. Uh, that looks like the dog you see in all the paintings from the Elizabethan era. Inside the arena, there is a definite sense of competition. Who is this? This is Jacob. Jacob. Yeah. Hey, Jacob. But a more relaxed atmosphere prevails backstage. That's the best part of the day for me, really, to just to back there and just see the owners, and they're all talking with each other. They're having the best time. Preparing for that moment that could make their canine top dog. Mark Bark. NBC News. To Claire. This uh, Morgantown dog won three awards at the 2022 National Dog Show. Meet T Pup. That's a uh, nine month old show dog originally from Poland who won this year's awards for the winner's dog, best of winners, and best of breed owner handled. Now, last weekend was T Pup's first ever dog show, but was still named best in breed out of the dogs that are not already declared champions. The French call them the antidepressant dog. Um, they're just, they're lovely family companions. Um, they are a big dog in small dog's clothing. They're not hyper or uh, crazy or insane as far as temperament's concerned. They're very laid back and easygoing and happy-go-lucky. Yeah, I believe that. <laughs> and if you'd like to see T-Pub compete, you can tune in to the National Dog Show again. That's tomorrow at noon here on WBOY NBC.